Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to write a C program to find the sum of the digits of a given number. So this is my C program for calculating the summation of the digits of a given number. At the top I have these two header files, studio.h and studylibrary.h. Then I have a main function. Inside a main function I have defined some integer variables. After that I'm prompting the user for an input. Whatever the user will input gives the input that is stored in this variable num. Then I have a while loop out here which will run until and unless this condi condition becomes false. So until and unless the value of num is greater than 0, it will keep executing these three statements. So the first statement here is num model is 10. So this means whatever the number that you user has input given as an input that will be divided by 10 and the remainder will be stored in this variable rem in the second case second operation I'm dividing the number by 10 and storing the value in num in the third case I'm summing I'm adding the value of num to the sum and this while loop will keep on executing until and unless the value of num becomes smaller or equal to zero and finally I'll use this statement to print the value of sum so let's see this with an example so if I give a number 1 2 3 4 in the first iteration the value of sum is 0 the value of num is 1 2 3 4 so remainder will be 1 2 3 4 modulus 10 so that will give me, give me a remainder of 4 which I will be store in REM similarly in num the value of num will be 1 2 3 point 4 because this is the value that you get when you divide 1 2 3 4 by 10 however since num is an integer it will truncate the decimal part and only store 1 2 3 in the last part sum I'm adding the value of sum with remainder so that gives me 4 in the second iteration the value of sum has changed from 0 to 4 num is now this 1 2 3 remainder is when you when you when you do a modulus operation on 1 2 3 the remainder is 3 Similarly, when you divide 1, 2, 3 by 10, the value is 12.3. Since it is an integer value, it will truncate the decimal point and store 12. Then I am adding sum with the remainder value. So that gives me 4 plus 3 equal to 7. Similarly, these are the iteration, third iteration, what is happening in the third iteration, in the fourth iteration, what is happening. And eventually in the fifth iteration, the value of sum will be 10 and the value of num will be 0 because in the fourth iteration the value of num was 1 so when you divide 1 by 10 the value you get is 0 0.1 so the num has become 0 out here so the while statement condition is false here so it will terminate it will come out of this while loop and print the value of sum so the final value of sum 10 is printed in the terminal. So this was the C program to find the sum of the digits of a given number. Thank you for watching the tutorial. Have a nice day.